Hi everyone, and welcome back to another video by Wondershare Repair It, professional video, photo, and file repair software. Have you ever faced issues while using Excel spreadsheets, especially when it comes to formula errors? One wrong click can break a spreadsheet, from accidental deletes to misplaced data, and undoing the damage can be time consuming and annoying. Today, I'll show you how to fix these Excel problems. But before we get started, let us know any other problems you're facing with Microsoft Excel in the comment section down below. And don't forget to subscribe to the Wondershare Repair It YouTube channel. Now, even the most experienced Excel users run into formula problems now and then. So we've compiled a list of solutions to hopefully save you time fixing the problem. Before talking about solutions, what are the most common Excel formula errors? This Excel error means there isn't a value to be found. It occurs when the function applied to a cell does not have a value. Technically, this isn't a formula error, but rather something manually entered into the cell with an error, most likely with a bad reference. The num error indicates that the issue is related to the number that's used in a formula. This error can be caused by an invalid function parameter or a number that's too tiny or large has been used. This is the most common Excel error. It will appear if the number in a cell is divided by zero or has an empty value. This error will normally occur when the formula involves a variety of values. It occurs when one or more cells in a spreadsheet have text instead of numbers for mathematical processing. It could also be caused by the cell's offset function. This Excel error is related to the width of the cell. It displays if the cell data is too wide for the cell. And instead of displaying all the characters, it just displays the hashtag symbols instead. This error occurs when the specified intersection between two ranges of cells has no actual intersection. When you use a space instead of a comma to describe the union operator between ranges of cells, you'll get this error. This is the Excel error that occurs when you use the incorrect name for an operation. The hashtag name error is normally caused by an incorrectly written range name, a reference to a deleted range, or no quotation marks in the text string. This Excel issue is caused by an improper cell reference, as the name suggests. The spreadsheet will display this problem if you delete a cell linked to a specific formula, or paste another cell over it that isn't tied to the formula. Now that we know what errors are most common in Microsoft Excel, let's find out how to fix them. So now we're going to cover how to fix these problems in Excel, as well as effective strategies for resolving them. To fix this error, carefully examine the entire calculation to determine which sheets or rows were deleted or referenced incorrectly. If a few formulas are connected together, make sure that each formula has a value. To correct this error, check if you've entered any problematic data into the formula, such as money, dates, or special characters. If you have, remove these values from your formula. Fixing this next error is quite straightforward. Just modify the value of a cell to something other than zero, or add a value if the cell is blank. The hashtag value error will show if you've used text instead of numbers in your formula. So recheck your formulas before applying them. To fix this error, just increase the width of your column to fit all the cell data. It can be a little tricky to fix this particular error because you have to make sure you're using the correct syntax in your formula. When referring to a continuous range of cells in a formula, use a colon to separate the first and last cell. And when referring to two cells that do not intersect, you should use a comma. To fix this, check the formula for spelling errors. 
If you type your formulas in lowercase, Excel will automatically change it to uppercase if it's recognised. To fix this error, be careful when pasting a group of cells. Make sure there aren't any formulas that will be altered if a cell is deleted. Also, if you unintentionally erase a cell, you can recover it by using Ctrl Z. Manually fixing the content of XLSX files can usually fix minor corruption issues. However, these manual methods won't work if the corruption is severe. Sometimes you'll have to use an Excel file repairing pro program. Sometimes you'll have to use an Excel file repairing program to get your Excel file back in working order. And one of the best options for this is Wondershare Repair It. Here's how it works. Download and run Wondershare Repair It. Select the damaged Excel file to be fixed. Click the repair button to start the repair. The software will now repair the damaged Excel file. Once done, you can get a preview of the repaired file and save it to your preferred location. Wondershare Repair It is the one-stop solution to repair the various problems you experience in Microsoft Excel. That's how to fix the most common problems with Microsoft Excel. Don't forget to download Wondershare Repair It to fix a wide variety of Excel problems. Thanks for watching, and let us know any other problems you're facing with Microsoft Excel in the comments section down below. Please give this video a like if it helped you, and subscribe to the Wondershare Repair It YouTube channel for more educational videos. I'm Dan, and I'll see you next time.